giving birth. I still remember like it was yesterday. I received prenatal care from the hospital that's actually around this my neighborhood. Since I was really small, um, they thought that I was gonna have a miscarriage or that the baby might come out with um, like a deformity or something. The contractions were just so bad, it was paralyzing. So I couldn't speak, couldn't do anything. It was just painful. I have had four children, and with three of them, there have never been any complications in the pregnancy or the birth, which led to the birth of the baby in week 29 in the pregnancy, and then the baby died after a year. My mother was very young. She 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 was very young. My birth experience was horrible. <laughs> I was in early labor, so I was there for like three days. The hospital kept sending me home. It was in the winter, so it was snowing outside, and the doctors had the nerve to tell me to go walk around because I wasn't getting any contractions. Mm. The gravity, the one who was after the baby who died, I experienced it as it was very difficult to feel. I was afraid for it to happen, and I had experienced that the worst could happen. So everything was very different, even though it was purely physical. Everything was in order, and nothing was to be concerned about. But I was very often filled up with my mother and my mother. The midwife said that feel free to call me anytime and I didn't feel her to come so we were together with my uh, husband um, I didn't have pains so we had uh, spent several hours being together and I think that was a very um, special period of time in the hospital I didn't feel safe at all the doctor was he was just being a complete idiot with me. He kept telling me that every time I was pushing, he would be like that I was pushing like a wimp. And he was just drinking coffee and watching his TV. Well, there was like several other student doctors who were there practicing who were... Actually, I think they did a better job than the actual doctor did. The experience was very liberating. I, I was just overwhelmed with emotions. I was crying. But I was happy I was finally able to hold my child's stomach. I was able to hold him in my arms and it was just the best feeling ever. I was happy that my mom and my child's father they were both there when I was giving birth and that's all that mattered. Life completely changed. The first months I was struggling with breastfeeding and uh, learning what to do with the baby so it took quite a long time to, to real, realize that you know how connected we are and to it took, took time for me to, to really connect to him. My motherhood instincts kicked in as soon as he came out. So I was just all for him. It was no longer, uh, it was no longer Sana's world. It was Sana in Kevin's world. 